We got that back in. And we got that on. Now we're just waiting for that to come in. Thanks a lot for coming along with Life with Belsif. Let's see what's really going on. How you doing today? Welcome to Life with Belsif. Today, we're drinking ourselves a coffee here. And we're tinkering. You kind of like to tinker. Sometimes tinkering is good to do. But I want to put this other side rail on the golf cart because we haven't done that yet. And you might as well just hang out here and have an eye and see what you think. Because that's what you do, I heard. I'm kind of mellowed out today. Where'd that go? I just seen something need in a minute. And I lost it already. I don't like these drawers at all. They suck. Oh, careful. Well, what the hell happened to them? Oh, God. Here we go again. Looking for my lock nuts, Jim. So, last time we did these side rails, I didn't bring it along with for the ride here. You have to put a piece of wood on here if you don't have any of the original plastic side pieces here. These are designed to go over top of the originals. I'm just saying, because if you don't put the wood, they don't quite sit right, they don't. But when you put the wood, they fit perfect. Friggin' right they do. So let's get this sucker on. We'll tighten her up and see what's what. I gotta get down on my knees here. Oh, dick, how do you get into that one? I think we have to go from the seat side. Oh, just so you know, still waiting to hear back from the company. That's the wrong size. We need a different size, we do. So, we're still waiting to hear back from them. And holy crap, is that ever in there? How the hell am I supposed to get in there? Oh, this one's going to be tough, Jim. Oh, dick. How the hell are you supposed to get into there? Holy. I have to put her in the old doodad first. Slide her in. Pull this out. Get her lined up. Maybe. What the hell? Oh, dick. Oh, dick. Not too far. Dropped it again. Why wouldn't I? Dropped it again. Freak, you gotta see where I am here. And then you'll understand. I don't know if you can see or not. Dropped it again. Alright, something might be happening. Grab it. Wrong me. I might have got her started. Maybe. Sure did. There we go, I got it started, so now we can tighten it up. It's not a fun spot to get to. There we go, there's one. We gotta get this baby done so we can put her on the market. Two. Take a drill bit, drill a hole in there. We put those ones down through and Bob's your uncle. Not much to put the side rails on. Not much at all. There we go. Perfect. Oh, oh. Stick them through there. Like so. Of course the rubber mat's gonna be in the way, but we'll get her through, don't worry. I knew that rubber mat was gonna get in the way. Had a feeling about that, it did. Damn mat. You can see it, it's right in the way. Not very talkative today. I'm kinda quiet today. I am gonna lose my on this rubber mat though. I'll tell you that right now. Finally. Frig. <laughs> it's right at the frame seam is where I gotta put this nut. <laughs> I think we got her. That's hilarious. There we go. There's one. Hey, one. Just jab it in there. Wow. I knew I should have cut that away first. I was gonna cut that plastic away first and I didn't and I, now I'm regretting every second of it. Yep, plastic is right there. Right there. God. Holy f man, are you f***ing for real? I'll get rid of that goddamn thing. I don't know if you ever go to an arena. That's what this rubber is like. The mats you put your skates across, hey? It's tough shit, but I'm gonna win because that's what I do. See, it's already going in. I won, again. We even got the nut started already. This shit can't fuck with me because I win every time. Captain. There we go, done. So another skid plate on and mounted. And look how good that looks. It's a little dusty, but hey, she looks good, she does. So we're done that one. So we're doing good. Doing real good. But see how this one sits in? The other side sits out like this a little bit, and the other side sits in. I don't think there's much I can really do with that. It's just the shape of the body, unfortunately. But next, what we need to do is we need to move the charge machine back out to where it's supposed to be. Because I gotta lift the cover off to put the charger on this thing, and I keep getting my hands all dirty and dicked over. So we gotta get this back to where it's supposed to be. So let's do that next. And the first thing we gotta do on that 
is disconnected, which is this guy. Make sure we're in maintenance mode. Always make sure you're in maintenance mode before you start fucking around, okay? Because if it's not maintenance mode, you can cook her. All right, so there's one off, there's two off, and we gotta take off a reed plug. And there we go, that's disconnected. So now we can take over the bench, get rid of that rivet. Just can't use them no more, no more, no more. Hit the road, Jack. Let's come back, no more, no more, no more, no more. Hit the road, Jack. Back what you say? What did you say, Captain? I said hit the road, Jack. Now when you're doing this, always use a tiny, small drill bit in case you slip. There you go. And now we should be able to knock that right out of there, maybe. Nothing else has been easy today, so I don't know how this is gonna be. But hey, it is what it is, it is. We'll slap her in the bus and we'll give her a whack job. There you go. Out she goes. So on this one, we're gonna use we're gonna use normal stainless bolts for this one, as long as they have the right sizes. But we don't, so we're gonna use bigger ones. We are, so we're gonna have to drill bigger holes, which is okay because I know how to do that. So we'll drill a hole here, and then we'll make sure it fits, which it doesn't. So we need a bigger drill bit. So we'll drill a hole here, and we'll drill a hole here, and we'll drill a hole here. And we'll drill a hole here. Ow, finger. And now that should go in. There you go. So now we gotta go over to the cart. Don't forget to subscribe and like and hit the notification bell bar button if you like this kind of video. Why wouldn't you? This thing's gonna go right in there. So I need my knee pad. So we'll get right down dirty here with you. And we'll slide this thing right in. Careful, don't mark the friggin' awesome paint job. Slide that in like that. And there she is. So now what we need to do is we need to drill the bigger hole here. That, we'll get one started. Put them down on the other side. And we'll get the next one started. Here it is. Bolt washer. Not nothing like some good stainless gem. And let's get them two snugged up. Make sure everything's sitting right. Normally I power to all this stuff, but this is plastic, so we'll just go with this. Drill. Bolt washer. Nut. Bolt washer. Nut. Oh yeah. Tighten. I like it when it comes down to just uh, buttoning up stuff. It's a lot easier to work, not hard on your body. Just lay here and do what you gotta do, and everybody gets happy, especially the golf cart, because it knows. They know, they know when they're coming together, they do. They start to get happier, start to tell all their golf cart friends about it. It's pretty good. Free and right's pretty good. Look at that, eh? That's fucking decent right there. So that's done. So now we can hook it back up. Hopefully you can see nothing. We'll run this way this time. And we want, which one's positive, damn it? I can't remember now. That one's positive over there. So we'll run it this way and we'll come through here like so. Oh man, oh man, that's tight. Maybe we can't do that. Let's take that out. So we'll run this through here like so. There we go. Run it that way. We'll run this one this way. Perfect, positive. Perfect. And reed valve, or trigger, or whatever you want to call that thing. Perfect. So there you go. That's all hooked up. Positive, trigger, ground, doodad. Friggin' right, so we did it. So that's good, that's another thing done. That's two things done today on the golf cart. Like I said, I still gotta adjust the rear end, which is this week, maybe, and bring that forward a little bit. Get that seat cover brought in right from good old cart parts superstore there. Wait and hear back from them on that cover. Once that comes back, we'll recover the seat, put a few blue LEDs in there, and we'll go for a rip. Friggin' right we will. But we gotta take this thing apart and make a new backing for that, so we're gonna do that. Leave the comments down below if you wanna see that on a video, because I always like to know that kind of stuff if you wanna see that kind of stuff. So we gotta make a new piece of wood for that one too, with some new DeWalt power tools. Captain, friggin' right. Hopefully everyone's having a good day like I am, not doing anything I ain't doing. Love y'all, thanks for being here. Welcome any new subscribers. And until next time, you know what to do for now.